First game back after the All-Star break for two teams that have played a whole lot of close games this year. The Celtics and Cavaliers, Kyrie Irving scored 23 back on January 29th, including this drive, spin, and deuce to give the Cavs an 88-87 lead. Late in the fourth quarter, the Cavs would go on to beat the Celtics. Back on Tuesday night, Paul Pierce steals it, drives down the court. Kyrie Irving steps in to take the charge. Irving injures his right elbow on the play, would leave the game with a right elbow contusion. And his team was trailing, but Irving is tough and he would return in the third quarter. Anthony Parker to Irving who spots up and the MVP of the Rising Stars Challenge puts Cleveland up by three. Now Kyrie, some defense, and he drives down the court and takes the elevator to the rim. Part of a 13 point third quarter performance Cavs up by five. What a move by Kyrie. Out of the fourth quarter, a veteran getting involved. And from Boston, it's Kevin Garnett. 18-point performance, including this one high off the window to tie the game at 66 and 66. Ramon Sessions blows the layup. Tristan Thompson flies in for the putback. Back to a two-point lead for the home team. Paul Pierce from way downtown, and that's the truth. 78-76 Boston. Antoine Jameson looking to match Pierce with a triple of his own. No good, but the rookie is there. Irving tips it in, he had 24, we're tied at 78. Cavs now lead by one after Kyrie Irving makes two free throws. Kevin and Garnett tips Kyrie Irving's pass, Celtics on the break. Here comes Ray Allen, part of a 22 point night. 82-81 Boston. Celtics lead by three after Ray Allen makes a pair of free throws. Cavs, one last chance for the tie. Anthony Parker, front iron, no good. And Boston wins it, 86-83. The Celtics put an end to their five-game slide. All three games between these two have been decided by three points or less.